Now we'll ask Frank Crumbles about that, but you would have to think that's coming from up top and that the Pirates want to see Tobin in left field. Well, earlier today, he had this lineup card complete before we started the game. We resumed our game, and I asked him about the switch as I saw it was crossed out and there was a seven next to Tabata's name. And his simple answer was, yeah, I move, we're moving Tabata to left and Moss in center, and I'm with you. With Kyle Stark, minor league coordinator in town, and with it being scratched out, that meant that Tabata originally was in center. Let's move him to left, have him get comfortable in left, because if Tabata, when he makes that jump to the big leagues, he's not playing in center. That belongs to Andrew McCutcheon. He would be playing in left field, and eventually he needs to become more accustomed to playing in left field. The problem has been the Indians do not have a true center fielder to give him that chance to move to left. Total strikeouts. And Jose Tabata swings and grounds and foul left. And there's a pitch in on Jose, a ball. And two runs scored in the first game. This one is a little inside, a ball, two and one. McAllister's the number five prospect in the Yankees system, according to Baseball America. Fastball, power fastball, they say, and an excellent curveball. And the pitch is pop foul to the right side, out of play. Just here as the starter, that was the best batting average against in his career. And there's a bouncing ball wide of third. The shortstop has it go off his glove into left field as Corona could not make the play. And a base hit for Tabata. Well, once it's past Cusick, it's an infield hit. Cusick couldn't cut it off. As soon as it's by him, it's an infield hit, even if it's backhand in the hole by Corona. He needs to make an unbelievable play to get Tabata, who can simply fly down the line at first. The right-hander stretches, and he pitches. And a ground ball wider first. It goes off the glove of the first baseman. And Huffman picks it up and flips it to the pitcher, McAllister covering, and they get Diaz. Three to one, Tabata advances to second. Oh, McAllister bounces off of that mound. That's a big target for a first baseman to hit that big pitcher running over the bag at first. Maybe going for the slide. Myro's on on the fielder's choice, and a changeup is this. And there's a swing and a miss at an outside pitch strike two. You know, and in a different spot, it might be a different story. And this one's over the outside corner. A fastball strike three called. He changed speeds effectively on Alvarez. Say top of the batter. He takes a breaking ball in there for a strike. We're tied at three in the bottom of the second. A round of it. Everything. A one pitch. Driven in the air to right center. He belted that one the other way. It's way back. It is off the wall in play. And Tabat is into second standing with a double board. And he drive back. And Howard Jose Tabata didn't watch it. As soon as he hit it, he sprinted out of the box. He was thinking three. If it's a home run, he'll slow down. But a nice play by the outfielders. Keep it at second base. You know, Tabata could have coasted into second base the way that ball was hit. But he was digging out of the box, thinking bigger than that, and he ends up at second. And the batter, Arjenes Diaz, who grounded the first, his first time up. Fourth hit of the inning. First two were infield hits. Diaz grounds it right to the third baseman. q 6 got it. Throw to Huffman, inning over. Damage done at the end of two. Scranton Wilkesbury, three. Indianapolis, three. Watching uh, tennis, uh, that's all just a part of, of the uh, the residential. Uh, we're very proud of that. But um, we have expanded and developed many programs over the last. It, it, it was affordable. It was something for people who didn't want a big, big campus to deal with right out of high school. And uh, it, it was a great setting for the non of the game. This pitch to Tabata, slow roller to third. Charge to throw over to first base. Go to the opposite field. An RBI opportunity for Diaz as a breaking ball misses low. Drive trails. The pitch to Diaz, and it's a little low on that long shot. Pitch to Diaz, to the right side, gobbled up by the second baseman. He'll throw over to first and retire Diaz. You can see they really work on Pedro. And a fastball is outside a ball. 
Everybody knows about the big money he got, the fact that he was the number two pick in the nation in 2008. And you can see them changing speeds. Here's a pitch outside. That's a ball, and it's 2-0. and And you know that you need to be on your game when you attack him. I mean, he doesn't have to completely square up on a ball to really hurt you. Great bat speed. He takes it outside, 3-0, and and you can see the opposition changing speeds and trying to get him to go after pitches out of the strike zone. Now it's 3-0. and This pitch. Strike called over the outside corner, belt high. Seven to four, Scranton. Last of the fifth. Scranton won the suspended game 10 to seven. Here's a line drive up the middle, base hit center field. Angle, he's doubled, he's grounded out. It's the last chance for the try. And the first pitch is inside ball one. The 1-0 delivery. He drops a butt along the third base line. Bare hand pick up and a throw and a terrific play by Matt Cusick. The pitch to Diaz. Fastball right down Meridian. Strike one. And there's a ball hit in the air to right field. Weber moving toward the line. He's there and he has it very quickly. Two men are out. 